Hello everybody, this is Old Soldier. Today we're going to talk about active wear sandals. Boots are great, but what about the summer months? Flip flops are great, but what about if you have to run or climb over something and you need your footwear to stay on your feet? These are also great for walking in and out of water in warm weather. First up is Teva. These are Teva Terrify. The current model is the Terrify 5. These are an earlier model, and quite frankly, I don't know which one. Uh, I first had a when they came out in the 90s, uh, the Teva Basics, which were, in fact, an awesome sandal. And I had those for 10 years until they simply would not... They broke. I couldn't use them anymore. So these were the replacement. And I still use these. Now, there was a bit of period of time where I didn't use them because the soles came separated. And um, eventually what I did is... I reattached them with shoe goo, and we'll see how this works out. But um, I might have these taken professionally to a. Uh, I might have these taken uh, professionally to somebody and have them resold uh, because the soles came off, but they're still hanging in there. Um, when I bought these, they were about I want to say seventy seventy five dollars. Uh, a pair of the uh, Teva Terrify fives. I think are a little bit under $100. So I will give these a thumbs up, wear durability. Um, one thing I will say, and it's just my personal opinion, sandals with socks is never a good fashion choice. Next up is the Keens Men Water Shoes. Uh, these are what I bought for the replacement when the soles went on the Teva, and quite frankly, I have liked them a lot. I really do enjoy the rubberized toe, the toe protection. I use these a lot. I use the Tevas also for fishing in and out of the water and climbing over rocks and wet rocks. And sometimes I slip and it is really nice not to smash your toes into other, um, into rocks or other things. Uh, the soles on these are still just fine. The weak point, and I think it's primarily because I do use these in the water so much, the elastic band in the rear on both shoes in the set have dry rotted and stretched out. And it's, they're just, they're not in great shape. And when they give up, that's going to be the weak point. Otherwise, they are coming in strong. So maybe, I don't know, maybe I make sure to drive or dry them off uh, after I use them. Uh, they're great. They're comfortable. Uh, I really can't recommend them enough. One thing I will say, the Keens Water Sock is more expensive. Uh, when I bought these, I want to say they were about 110 I just looked on the internet and they were about 130 US dollars. I think these are both great pieces of footwear. What would I do if I only had to have one? I'd probably have to give the nod to the Keens just over the foot protection. Uh, if protecting your feet is the overwhelming factor for you, then I'd have to go with the Keens. If it's price point, I'd have to go with the Tevas. They are more affordable and they both hang in there. They're both fairly rugged. But hey, it depends upon what's, uh, what choice is yours. Personally, I'm going to keep them both. Uh, when I have to get a replacement set, which one will I go down to when they both wear out? Probably just the Keens water shoes. Well, anyway, that's my review. This is Old Soldier, out.